Look at this beautiful incubator. Ain't cooking the eggs of the later part of the season. We have some false chameleon eggs that I think might actually hatch. We haven't hatched those in a while. This is another clutch from Lily, our Conda Het Lavender. Looks like they're not hatching quite yet. That's all right. There's a lot of condensation in there. Are you guys starting to, to hatch or do? Uh, nope, no pips yet. How about, oh, oh, there's a face. Mad hogs, mad hogs are hatching. Oh my goodness, baby hog noses. Baby giant hog noses, I should say. Oh my gosh, look at all these. This was our Pokemon clutch. Is there a face in here? Oh, there is, but you can't see it on camera. Oh, it looks like Mewtwo pipped and has a bunch of spit bubbles. Mewtwo, do you want to say hi? Not yet. Okay, how about Voltorb? Oh, Voltorb definitely pipped. There's a lot of slices in that egg. Oh my gosh. Will Togepi or Dratini? Oh, Dr Dratini already pipped too. Oh my gosh, guys, you got, you're, you're all hatching. And I think we still have, there's an egg at the very bottom there too. Okay, we're gonna come back tomorrow and see if these guys are coming out. All right, it's been a day. Are these guys coming out yet? <gasps> yes, they are. Oh wow, there's a lot of babies out. Okay, I think what we're gonna do is get these babies separated, the ones that are out. So, oh, look at you. Uh, so they're not so crowded. And then we can cut open the remaining eggs and see who's all still gonna come out. Okay, babies, I have a little container here that I'm just gonna put back in the incubator because I want them to stay in there for a couple more days until everybody comes out. Oh my gosh, there's a face. Hello, welcome to the world, little Diglett baby. That's right, this was our Pokemon clutch. Oh, you're trying to squeeze back in, aren't you? Well, let's see who all we have. Oh my gosh, look at you beautiful babies. Let's get you a little bit more space. Come here. We're gonna move you over here. Perfect. I misted down the paper towel so it'll keep them nice and hydrated while we wait for all their siblings to hatch. There you go, gonna go right into that half log. Yep, look, look at that. Hi, baby. Welcome to the world. Oh my goodness, you're so squiggly. There, okay, go into the half log here. Do you wanna go in there too? No? Here, I think you do, I think you do. Come on, there you go. Okay, perfect, got three there. And it looks like, let's see, Dratini hatched. That baby Togepi has pipped and actually looks really good too. I can see it moving, perfect. I haven't cut any of these. I think they may have all pipped on their own. Oh my gosh, even the one way down at the bottom, I think that one hatched. Oh my gosh, that one already hatched. Okay, so that one hatched. Uh, Dratini hatched. Mewtwo, did you hatch? I don't think you hatched. Uh, yes, it looks like Mewtwo has hatched, okay? And so those are our three babies that we just pulled out. So we're still waiting for uh, Diglett, Togepi, and Voltorb to hatch. But they all pipped their own eggs. I'm so proud of you guys. Good job. All right, I guess we don't have to cut any eggs. We'll just wait another day or two and t until they all come out. And then we get to look at all of you beautiful babies. All right. You guys have to see this. The babies are, where'd you go? There they are. I think they're all out now. So I'm gonna bring that and the babies we've already taken out and we're going to add some siblings to your container. Yes, and then tomorrow I'll come back and we'll set up baby bins because it's, I'm kind of in a rush. Oh my goodness, you did come out. Oh wow, and you're in blue. I haven't been here for two days and you're already in blue. Hi cutie. You guys all pipped all by yourself. You didn't need my help. I'm so proud of you. And look, now you're out. Oh, look at those little tongue flicks. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's get you a little bit more space. You come here. Come here, little baby. You look nice and healthy. Here, go in a cave, join your siblings. Perfect. I'm gonna add a little bit of dechlorinated water. This will just be for overnight. I just feel bad that they're in there and I don't want them to be super squished. So they can go in there to have a little bit more space. Here's another baby, oh my gosh, come on, come on. You look healthy, look at you, look at those checkered sides. And then last but not least, well actually you might have more room now that you're by yourself. And is anyone here still due to pit or come out? I think everybody's out, otherwise, okay. Well cool, I might leave that one in by himself overnight. So he has enough room and these guys can just share this container overnight and I will be back tomorrow. It isn't here, we actually are moving right now. Um, that is something else, that's not these guys. Um, we're gonna come back tomorrow and move them into baby bins but now they have a little bit more room overnight. Ah, more mad hogs! Oh, that way, mad hogs. This split up clutch 
which as I think it's enjoy, they've enjoyed the extra space rather than all being crammed in here. But now it is time to take them out and put them in baby bins. But first we have to take a look at all the babies, obviously. Yeah, of course. So let's see all the babies now that they're out. And uh, and now that Ed is here too, because um, last time we filmed, it was just me. So I just moved some over so they weren't all crammed in here. But now it's Ed's first time seeing them. Oh, look at them. Oh, look at you guys, your big blocky heads are the best. Oh my goodness. So the brown stuff in here is sphagnum moss, in case anybody was curious. It looks like one of the eggs, did you go bad? You must have gone bad, you look really gross. All right, so we have one, two, this was our Pokemon clutch, which was one, two, three, four, five, six eggs. We have two babies in here. So we have. Do we have four in here? This is a gross paper towel because they've all had their first poops in it. Oh my goodness. We have one, two, three, four, five. Wait. How did, how, how did that work? Okay, so we have five. Uh, did, did the moldy egg actually hatch? Okay, so hang on. How many eggs do we have? Did I miscount? One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, if you count that one. Did you hatch? Oh, never mind. There's another egg down there. Ah. I didn't even see that egg. Whoa, we didn't have to cut any of these. Like they had all pipped themselves or cut the eggs so I didn't have to cut any with knives. But I didn't realize there was even an egg down there. So that one hatched too. So we had seven? So we had seven. Yeah. Do we have seven here? Um, one, two, three, one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven. Perfect. Look at that, they all hatched. Aww. Aww. And they're actually pretty calm too. I just love that checkerboard pattern here. Yeah. Look at that, you are so pretty. Seven, okay, I wanna hold them all. Seven baby Madagascar giant hog noses. Oh my gosh. Oh, the one on my arm is trying to be scary. Oh, look at you. that. You're so scary. I'm so hooded up, wait, wait. I wanna poke them. Poke, 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 Duh! poke, poke. Oh, you made him flatten out even more. Can I make him flatten out down further? Oh my goodness. Nope. Oh, okay, if you're gonna be sassy, hang on, hang on. Are you the sassy one of the clutch? You got an escape artist here over here too. Oh yeah. Oh, he's okay. flattening out. Oh my goodness. Now that one's the sassy one. Oh, touch, 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 oh, touch, touch, touch. You're so scary. So scary, look at you all flattened out. As soon as you pick them up though, they calm down. Yeah, it's, it's like, like, well, I'm not dead yet, oh. Oh, look at you, now you're the, oh. You just struck at me! Whoa. Oh my gosh! A little jerk! I didn't know they would do that! Oh my gosh! Oh. Hey! Hey! Let go! <laughs> oh my gosh! Would you stop that? Ow! They're you... not uh, slightly venomous, are they? They are! Well... Did that just happen? I guess we're gonna see if Emily is allergic to their venom. What? I mean, they're rear fanged, and I don't see any big tooth holes here, so. What a jerk! He wasn't, that wasn't even just a tag. He was like chomping down. He's oh hungry. Oh my gosh. Okay, buddy, I'll set you back there again. You wanna do that again? No, I think. Uh... I'm good. <laughs> it's funny with the bull snakes. <laughs> yeah, but they, they start chewing on you. They don't yeah, just- Yeah, like trying to get that venom into you. Oh, maybe that, maybe it was a self-defense that, well, okay, we'll check back in on this, I guess in a little bit, and we'll see if uh, there is any allergic reaction. I don't think there will be, but I suppose <laughs> we'll give it a little time and check back. Um, I guess in the meantime, I will clean up my hand and we'll put them in baby bins. <laughs> okay, so instead right, Michael- Actually, okay, first, before we do anything else, What'd you just tell me about that little, uh... It's itchy. It's itchy, huh? Yeah, 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 it's itchy. So, so there far. you go, there's the first, uh, first check-in on her knuckle. Yes, and also for baby bins, we are down to two remaining baby bins in the baby rack. But we have a plan, so we'll explain more about that in a little bit. For now, we are just going to set these up and put three in one and four in the other. So we've got our rock is something rough. We've got a little hide in the back. We know YouTube doesn't like blood. Oh yeah, we're gonna cover up my hand so YouTube doesn't demonetize this whole video. We've got water dishes, lots of plants. Look at that. We can have a flower, and this one can have two flowers. Oh, beautiful. Perfect, I think that'll work. And obviously we will add water to the water dishes after filming this video. So we're gonna put... Let's we'll see if Emily can get bit again. Yeah, really? One, two, three in there. One, two, three, four in that one. Hooray. Perfect, got all our babies. And actually, there's a surprise too. We actually had a third clutch of Madagascar giant hognose eggs. It was a lot smaller. It was a clutch of one. <laughs> so we incubated. So big. You are a big baby. We you incubated it monster. with a single albino hognose snake egg, uh, and they both hatched. So the this hognose is gone. It's in another another bin and another video already. But this one just hatched. 
So yeah. here's the Madagascar Still giant. Still shed even. Oh, look at you. Fresh Aww. little baby. Oh, you're hooding up too. Oh, you're so sassy. We know what happens when they hood up. Yeah, we do. <laughs> <laughs> look at you. You're so cute though. Okay, so I think what we're going to do, instead of doing four and three babies in the bins, we'll do four and four. Whoa. Hey, buddy. So upset. So this one is a few, about a week Younger, maybe five days younger than the rest because they've actually been hatched for a few days here. There you go, buddy, fresh out of the egg and now in your baby bin. Now you'll have friends too. We also have one that's escaping. Yep, and one is trying to get out. These guys are just troublemakers, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, they are. Here you go, go back in there. Yeah. Okay, now we have our babies. All right. Oh, we have three spots. Yeah, I guess we have three open bins, but we'll just do this so they're next to each other. Yep. Uh, so we're making it work with the last, I thought there were only two, but I guess there's a third bin. Anyway, we have all the babies in these two bins and we are selling slash shipping out like, like 15. Like this many, here to there. Like yeah. all of those are going out in like two days. <laughs> yeah, so they're gonna be together for now and then we'll kind of just, uh, spread them out a little disperse. bit. They'll disperse into other bins as soon as those all get shipped in two days. So they'll be fine for a couple days, yep. a little crowded. So- How's your finger? Go. Not itchy anymore. Is it swelled up? Not yet. I mean, he's just a baby. What all could Let's he do? Put your other finger up to it. I think that's slightly swelled up. I don't think so. Not yet anyway. It's a little red, but it's not swollen yet. It looks a little bit swollen. I think we would have had to let him chew for a bit longer to actually have effects. Maybe. But we'll see. We'll see. We'll give it more time. <laughs> so why is dad back here in the first place? Dad gets separated from all the girls every week because he will steal all of their food. He's a big chunky man. So we only feed him once every, what, three weeks now? I think it's every three weeks. <laughs> so uh, on his non-eating weeks, we have to pull him from the exhibit for the day so that the females can eat and he can't steal it. Because they need food and he obviously doesn't need food. No, he's chunky as this. All right, buddy, I suppose. Our moms ate all their food? Yeah, they ate everything, so it's actually safe for him to go back now. Nice. He can't so, steal their foods. Yeah, there you go. All the food is gone. You can't take any anyway. So good job, everybody. You had lots of beautiful babies this year. First time breeding Madagascar giant hogs. How crazy is that? We've been working at this for years. Three, two, three years? Three yes, years? and now it finally became a reality. Look at him staring at us. He's all he's offended. Like, he's like, you didn't give me any food. Yeah, now he's all mad. One of your kids bit me. Yeah, I hope you're happy. He's like, I'm glad you don't yeah. give me food. I'm so, I'm still stoked that we were yeah. able to produce these this year. It's like, mm -hmm. we've been working so long towards it and it finally happened. So anyway, uh, we will be reaching out to the waiting list. Uh, once, once they have a couple meals in them. Once they have a couple meals and then, yeah, then we'll be able to find them good homes. So thank you for watching. I hope you're as excited as we are over baby Madagascar giant hog noses. Madagascar giant hog noses. We have bred those now. That is amazing. Thank you, Patreon backers, for your wonderful support. And we'll see you next time.